Wait, please get me water. I know that's a good idea. Come on, get me drinking water. I've had you. But if I'm not here, won't you still drink water? You are sitting right here. Stand up and give me drinking water. I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm talking. Why are you stopping me? Can't you see I'm busy with my phone? Okay. If you are not giving back to me, won't you still drink water? Or we wait for Obia Geli to get water for you before you will drink. Okay. But you are here. And I get back to you. Come on. Stand up and give me drinking water. I asked for Pekiri to get me drinking water, but I'm choking. But Pekiri uh, uh, told me that if I did not give back to her, will I not drink water? Did you see how I am destroying this girl? Well, is, is that just all? No, is that just all? Is she wrong? If you haven't given back to her, will you not drink water? Do I am telling you. Do you know I, listen, I don't like this. This will be the last time you should ever touch this precious child. I don't want it. My only child one that will soon take me to uh, America, but don't you both. Look at how you have damaged her, uh, her, her shoulder. Alashus. Alashus, is this what you have to say? Is this what you have to say? Destroy her with the pamperin. I command her. I command her. My hand is not there. My, my hand is not there. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Please get up. Look at that. Eh? Yeah? Sit down. My back. It's okay. Please. Just sit gently. Sit gently like American oh. people. Oh my jewel. Eh? I hope she did not enjoy you too much. No. Eh? Just my back is pain. I, I will soon get a doctor to treat you. Eh? Oh, because of ordinary water. That's why she wants to kill you. Papa, leave her. Papa, please touch her. Yes, which, which area exactly, my daughter? Yeah. The middle back. Do, do, oh, hey, oh, oh, hey, oh. Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. You know, I'm not a doctor. I'm not a doctor. Have you eaten? No. Please, you have to take this food and finish it. No! This, 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 this food. But cover it. No. Cover it! I should cover it? Yes! That's good. That's good. We are shifted. Are you... Shifted. Uh -huh. Don't worry. Let's go and meet her so that we can ask for our own food, yeah? Please get on gently. Take carry it. me on. Carry me. Carry you. Yes. No, I can do it. Even though you want to turn me to crane. <laughs> I am ready to carry you. Eh? Please take it easy, mama. See my phone. Don't go for my phone. Uh -uh. When I'm not a madman. Oh, take, take it easy, mama. Please be walking like your mom. I don't thing. like it. They, they, are, they are jealous. They are jealous. They know the dragon of beauty. Open the door for me. I should open the door. Of course. I will be going this time now. Why should I waste time when I know my jewel is still passing? Take it easy. Need your What is going on? I've been sitting down here for the past 10 minutes. Where is my food? Your food? <laughs> Why don't you tell your second wife? I mean your first wife. See, she's the one that decides whatever happens in this house. Tell her not to give you food. Why are you going to do me? I mean, your man. My first and second wife? Papa. <laughs> Papa, Papa, mm -hmm. Mama refused to give me food. What? In this house? Be a need, Mama. Is it true? Is it true that you refused to give my Mama little food in this house? Did you refuse giving her food? I am talking to you, woman. Be a need, Mama. Papi, Mama. Papi, Mama. So you refuse to give my jewel food there? Eh? There is no problem. You can keep your food though, I am not interested. Since you have decided to refuse my Amalecha food in this house, eat your food. Amalecha, you know what? Let me take you out and buy you something. 
For real? Yes. What do you want to eat? Um, chicken. Fried or cooked? Fried chicken. Fried one. <laughs> you know why I love you? You know, you have the taste of presidents all over the world. They like fried chicken with all this uh, potato, pie and everything. Look at you, you're already practicing how to eat your country's money. <laughs> oh, Lecha, there is no time to waste. Jealous people, eat your food. We are not interested. Come, let me take you to that nearest uh, supermarket and get you good chicken. <laughs> I have to go inside the dress. No, no, you don't need to dress now. Let's go out there. Eat your food, though. Eat your food. You must give me the money for the food today. No! I don't have money. 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 I I don't like this. I don't like it at all. Why do you keep on fighting Papa over Obiagili? Nkechi, so I should just fold my arms and watch your father when you refuse to give me money for food? Huh? Mama, I know Papa is not doing the right thing. But you've been fighting this battle for years. And each time it gets worse. So why are you fighting? Nkechi, how can a child carry in my stomach for nine months? Dictate what happens in this house, in my own house. I want to put a stop to this. Obegeli only dictates what we want to eat. Whatever you want to do is from Obegeli. I want to stop this nonsense. I want to stop it. But Mama, I remember four years back, you decided that we should be doing whatever Obi says, which we all did. And there was peace in this house. No one had issue with Papa. After all, Obegeli is just a baby. Nkechi. Obegeli is mean. She is no longer a child. Look at how she lied to your sister the other day. And your father punished her severely. Check it now. It's not good. Mother, since we all know, know that Papa will do whatever Obi says, let's not fight. Instead, we should do whatever that makes her happy. So that maybe that way there will be peace in this house. Please. Where are you going to? Papa, I had a very big dream. What dream? What is it all about? In that dream, I was the president of this country what yes i was the first female president of this country and everyone was bound before me and calling me her excellency <laughs> if not that i love you so much eh? do you know what you are having a very serious malaria and i can see it in your eyes look at it hmm? yes papa oh he of little faith this is what Joseph's father and his brother were saying when Joseph had his own dream. Which Joseph are you referring to? Yes, Joseph in the Bible. He had his own dream. Then all his family were laughing at him. 
Even his brother and sister hated him because of this dream. But you know, his dream later came true. Mm, that is true. That is true. It's true. That means I will be the first female president of this country and everyone will bow before me. <laughs> Look at you. You have to have a minus. That means also that I will be the first father of the first female president of this country and people will also bow for me. <laughs> All because of me. Oh. Of course, it's because of you. From the day your mother gave birth to you, eh? Let me tell you, I know that you are going to be a great child. <laughs> I know too. Look at you. I <laughs> see you. I trust you. <laughs> okay. Look at, look at them there. They will oh be jealous. God. They will bow when you become a president. Even um, Ketian, they, even Mama, all of them will bow. You know what? When they bow for you, I will clean up the same place. They will bow for the both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. Wrong go. Don't tell them all. Okay. Yeah. I am happy. Sephobi, <coughs> there is something I want to speak with you about. What is it? I don't like the way you are spoiling that child. You are spoiling our child, you are overpampering her. I understand that she is the last born. But you are overpampering her to the extent that she is useless to herself. That girl has no respect to anyone. This is the height of it all and you are taking this too far. Woman. What is your problem? What is your problem? I am asking you. Can't you just leave me alone? Eh? If I talk to the other children, you will be the same person that will come to me and complain. Eh? But Bobby, you are too harsh. You are too harsh. You shout. You do everything. Now I am trying to apply a little bit of softness. You are still coming to complain that I am spoiling and destroying her. What is your problem, Wanya? It is better for you to be too harsh than being too soft. Yes. You are being too harsh to the older ones, but then it toughens them. Be too soft to our last born? Yes, I understand she was unexpected, and that makes you want to pamper her. But you are destroying her! Is that what you think? Is that what you think, that I am the one destroying her? Definitely, it's obvious. You know what? You people should leave the both of us alone, no? In this house, you people should leave us. Leave me alone and leave that girl alone. What is it now? Eh? You should leave us alone. Yes. Don't say that I did not warn you. Restra you are taking this too far. You are spoiling that girl. You are destroying her. sister how are you you know do what asked you to do or there's no discussion okay Gary I can't believe that you're expecting me your senior brother Emeka to greet you it's unfair I can see that you're getting worse hmm. every day what is it huh I can see you don't need your money because if you really need your money, you'll come and meet him. Okay, baby. Okay. It's me, you. Hey! 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 Hey, Mama don't burn up. Mama don't burn trouble. Big trouble. <sighs> I don't like what is happening in this house. I don't like it at all. Eh? How 
how can your father descend so low to obey that little brat? Mama, eh? Papa is Papa is spoiling that girl. He's destroying her. Spoiling that girl eh? for sure. Oh, good okay. girl. Mama, if you ask me, hmm, I will say you should use Obiageri and borrow money. Eh? <laughs> it's better I send her out as a maid. Mm, as a better see. still, as a slave. Mm. I see. Slave. More, more, more slave. Where is Mikichi? I see everyone is deaf. You can't hear me, right? Mm. You know my dream of becoming the president. And I always believe in my dream. Because my dream always comes true. As a result of that, I want all of you to address me as Her Excellency. What? Mm. What? 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 If you don't do so, I will cause trouble for you all. Touch me, I see. Touch me. Don't say I do not want Get out. all of you. Get out. I warn you. Don't say I do not want Get out from here. Foolish child. Very soon I will suicide you out for you and me. If I have my way, I told you that this day is up. The rest of me so to slave me. Mama, you are still talking. Let me say it. Mama, stop this girl. Stop this girl. Stop out. Hey, your father is my problem. It's not as if I don't know what to do. I hate that girl. I hate that girl. What kind of insult is this? What kind of insult is this? Hey, see this man though. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Naya! 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 Yeah. What's the meaning of this? Eh? I said, what's the meaning of this? Did I tell you I want to eat rice? <laughs> but Obi, rice and tea is your favorite now. Hmm. Must I eat my favorite every day? Hmm? Must I? We only prepared rice and stew yesterday. So you have to manage it. Okay. I have to manage it, right? I don't want to eat again. I don't want to eat. Now go. She don't ask me what I want to eat before you cook first. Get out! Excellency. Mother, that's funny. Uh, she something else. Uh, uh, what happened? Mama, my excellency says she does not want to eat rice. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. But I thought rice is her favorite. She said uh, we should have asked her first. You did not ask her before. I didn't ask her. Oh, go and ask her now. Go and ask her majesty what she will eat. Hmm? <laughs> mama. <laughs> but mama, that's what, your daughter wants to turn everybody to a slave in this house. Mama, <laughs> it's too much now. I can't see where you pass. I can't wait till you Huh? Hey! The one who gave me. What was it? Now, say it in a proper way. Your Highness, what was it? No, say it again in a cool way. Your Highness, what do you want to eat? Better.
I want to eat moi moi made with fish and meat. Okay, wait. I want Ma to prepare it for me. Why, if I may ask? Why? Because it is what I want, and I don't want you or Ikechi to touch it. Now, get out. Come back. That's what you need. In fact, get out. Hey, come! Did you just kiss? I'm sorry, Your Excellency. Oh, oh. Oh. This feels good. Everyone will so bow and obey me. Hmm. Yes, I think I will start making them meal before they talk to me. But will Papa agree? No, he won't like it. Hmm. I will try. <laughs> mama, you don't want mama with fish and meat. Hey. One of these, I'm just starting that girl. Mama, just let her be. Look at Ijoma. She's known in her husband's house. It's a two kids. Like now, she's no more worried about Obiakeli and her troubles. Now, me, very soon, HK will get married to me. And Mama is going to invest very soon. Then you can come to my house, or in this house. You can stay as long as you can. Mm. Yes. That is true, Mama. See, I don't want anything that will make Papa not to pay for my admission fees. So, anyway, I just have a few weeks to put up with that brat. Then she. What one of you are saying that we should just put up with her as usual? Huh? Yes, Mama. At least for now. Please, I want peace in this house. Please. Huh. Hmm. Okay. That is the point I'm worried about. She's a woman. Who will marry her? Will she marry? Marry. Mama, did you say marry? Who's going to marry that brat? You see? That is what I'm saying. She will get married one day. So, who will marry her? Eh? Mama. I will just lose that like that. No, I'm not for me. Eh? Please, Mama. There is nothing we can do. Just let her be, please. I don't have strength for Papa. I don't have I don't have it at all, please. Let her be. Yes. Yeah. Mm. <coughs> Excellency, good afternoon. Mikechi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Abi, how are you? What? HK. Did you just say, how are you? Yes. Mua, how are you? Hmm. I can see you don't have respect. Yeah, you don't have. But, you can't greet me. He was trying to greet... Don't talk when I'm still talking. As for you, I will teach you how to respect the future president of this country. I'll teach Mommy, you. He just, he will just... Stop it! You guys need to stop this. How 
can you greet and bow to a girl you give about 14 15 years? My dear, you don't understand. Understand what? We do what she wants, then our father give us what we want. If you try to correct her or do anything, my father will be on your neck. Firstly, this is not okay. This is not right. Your father needs to stop indulging this girl. Huh? Can you imagine how, he, how she was talking to me? Okay, you, you think we've not tried? My dear, we've tried. But it did not work out. Please, let, let's talk about something else, please. It's alright, let's go. You, my jewel. I'm fine, but I can see you really enjoying yourself. Oh, this. I just decided to light up my weekend. <laughs> oh, hey, Papa. Hmm? Papa, hmm? I want to tell you something. Something? Mm. Okay. Do you know that man that Sister Ike used to bring here? That useless man, AJK, you know him now. That wants to marry Sister Ikechi. Why did you call him useless man? He came here one day when Sister Ikechi was not around. Then he was making call. He was complaining that you are poor. That you are a poor man, that you don't even have money. Ha. Hmm. Hmm. He was saying that he wants to marry a girl that her father is rich, but he's still looking for one. He's hoping that you will sell one of your land and give it to them once he gets married to Sister Ikechi. Is that so? Yes, so. So that fool thinks he can cheat me? Mm -hmm. You know what? He will neither get that money and turn back to marry my own daughter. Yes! Yes! Mm -hmm. N not when I am still alive. Yes. Hm. I know that you won't allow any man to marry your daughter unless the man love her. Of course. Of course, because I know I am a wise man. Mm -hmm. Why would I do such a thing? Mm -hmm. You know what? Thank you for telling me. At least for me to prepare myself and guide myself before the time. I know you're a wise man and you would let that man marry Sister Ikechi. Are you just calling me a wise man? I am next to Solomon, <laughs> eh? the wisest man in the Bible. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. <laughs> what you, you, you want everyone to stand him? What do you want to ask me? The lady's name may be Ike. You! Papa! Papa! Lying down. But they've killed me. What? Who killed you? They've killed me. Please, man, get up. Get up. Just, I'm so sorry. Get up. What happened? Papa. Eh? Papa. Oh. What? Who touched you? Who beat you? Please. Papa. Eh? Mama. Yes. Ikechi. Eh? Aneye. Eh? Papa, they beat me mercilessly. Ah! They beat me. They said that. 
If I tell you they are going to kill me, Papa, do you want me to die? You, you mean that they all get ganged up against you? Papa, yes, I do these people will not forget that, that they have touched the tail of a tiger. Yes! I, honestly, let, I will do to them what tiger company does to Nigerian road. Yes, yes! Where are they? Miss Nene! Hey! Nene! Emeka! All of you should come outside though! Hey! Emeka! What is the meaning of this? After I've warned her, I don't like this at all. Nene, oh. where is your brother Emeka? He went out. You are seeing your mother. I know she's hearing my voice. No drama. No drama. Daddy, she's sleeping now. What kind of sleep is that after beating my daughter? Oh, oh no, 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 Is she not hearing that I've been calling? Yes, I, I called you. So, so you, so you, 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 you decided to go and sleep after after beating, beating my precious daughter. Yeah. Sorry, I, I, I fell asleep. I don't, I don't like all this. So, me, I have one beg you, one you time without number. I got all of you, and I, I, I begged all of you. I don't want anybody to touch this girl again. Yeah. What did you do today? The moment you saw that I left home, you ganged up with all these ones and they, 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 and beat her up. Yeah? Is it good? No, I don't. You're just talking. Are you just trying to say that I don't also have rights in all bringing of my daughter? Is that what you're saying? You don't have any rights. <laughs> you, you, you don't have any right. No, you don't. Let me make it very clear to you. Uh -uh. What is the meaning of all this? Daddy, we are sorry. It will not happen again. Yes, Papa, I promise. It will happen again. Papa, Papa, so you are believing them. Don't believe, believe these two people. They will still beat me again. Not only did, did, did you just beat her. Look, look, look at the way. Is this where they normally beat? Look at You want to tear her ear? Eh? No, you don't I want to. Uh, you have no? been complaining. Complaining about her ears. Do you even take notice of what I'm wearing? This girl is very wicked. She's me. She just dirty my clothes while I was beating her. Robbed me with mud all over my clothes. I have to go and freshen up and wear another clothes. Then before I slept off. Eh? I didn't even know this is why they are calling me. Ah. Uh -huh. If you want to beat her, when was the last time you watched television people beating somebody very close to the ear? If you don't have ear, will you need to tear her own away? It's okay now. It's not okay. Let her be here and be talking to me now. No, She's don't watch at me. She's very stubborn. And what about you? Are you not stubborn? It's okay now. No, let her be talking to me now. I paid your bride price. Your mother kept the money four days waiting, thinking that we'll return you if back. If I was this stubborn, will you, will, you come, will you have come to marry me? Eh? I'm not even here to exchange what we do. No, come, let me go and get you whatever you want. Papa, I don't eat. I want to sleep. Eh, please, come and choose any bed you like. Eh? You could be one. Uh -uh. I don't like this. I'm too beautiful. Nobody should touch this girl. Uh, no, no, don't open now. Let me be the one that opens the bed. Yeah? Stop opening this. Tell me you want. Just call me. I will do it for you. Hey, imagine. This man yeah. is destroying this man. I'm telling you. He's killing you her. Just, you just hear Afugo. Anyway. Afugo can work. <laughs> anyway, Mama. Noni. What I'm saying is that we are all in the same situation. So, let's just make our friend do what she wants and get what we want from Papa. Yes. As simple as that. Sister. I totally agree with you, but but the maker is the problem. You know he's very stubborn. How do we undo him? Yes, Mama. You need to talk to Emeka. You need to talk to Emeka. Emeka is he is probably stubborn. What is there to bow to bow to our uh, Bagheli? Let him just bow to her and get what he wants. After all, we all know that Bagheli is me. Yes. <sighs> anyway, I'll have what you possess. I'm not good. Hmm? I will cooperate and stop fighting. 
Yeah. What will I do? Let just for peace to ring. Just for, let me just give this a chance. Man, I don't want to come out the man. It's not well with me. I don't like what is happening. Man, I know you. Then as for maker, I also talk to him. I'll talk to him. I know how I'll go about him. He's my son. He listens to me. Yes, talk to him. Mm -hmm. I know uh, Pa is not in the right thing, but let's just let's forget about it. That and man the right thing. He's finishing that child for me. That is just my thing. No one more for now. I need your tender. What no man can do now. I need your tender. What no man can do. Only you can do what no man can do love. Only you can do what no man can do love. Only you can do what no man can do love. Papa! 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 Your voice, my glorious child. What is the problem, Papa? Mm -hmm. Papa, a teacher flogged me. What did you just say? A teacher flogged you? Yes. No, a teacher flogged you in your school? Yes. Don't they know whose daughter you are? Eh? Is the teacher mad? Papa, she's a new teacher. But I told her that nobody there flogged me. But she did not listen to me. Yet she flogged me. And and she violated it. Yes. Do you know where the food stays? Yes. Right away. Eh. Good. Take me straight to that place. Eh, Gobin, you're spoiling this child. You're spoiling her. <laughs> Do you even ask her what she did that made them flog her? Or what she did that made, made them punish her? Do I care? Do I care if she's the only one that got punished or the whole nation got punished? I don't care. Because the very first day I took this precious jewel to them, I told them that nobody should touch this child. I told them how important this child is. And today now they have violated our rules. It means I have to launch a pack on them. Please, take me straight. You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. Oh, this is very, very wrong. It is wrong. What is wrong? Let's go. Let's go. You have, it is, it is, if I'm going to kill seven people, you have made it eight. Let's go. It is very wrong, bro. I don't know, I'm It is wrong. Take it is wrong. not done. Hey, hey. I'm going to find you, What kind of character is this? What kind of training is this? What kind of character is this? You want to go and fight a teacher that discipline your child? Eh? God, have mercy. Mm. Now you just go to the school and disgrace me there. Disgrace the name of the family. Who is that? Very well. Afternoon, noon, Kegi. My teacher, are you the one that flogged my daughter? She was among the noise makers in the class. They were jumping and clapping in the class. I flog. How will I flog her without flogging her? Does it matter? Does it matter who is jumping or not? Let me ask you a very straight question. Don't people jump in your village? Don't you have people that are jumping? Don't you have people that that are talking? Don't the president and other people working with him talk? Is she the only person? Why did you single her out to flog her the way you did? I am asking you. You know what? How many strokes of candy did she flog you? Papa, ten. Ten. Then ten. Multiply by another ten. I, I, I flog you. What are you doing? I, 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 are you flogging me? Yes. How dare you flog my daughter? This is an abomination. This person must hear this. Let me tell you. I don't care about your principal. That's tiny net man. I don't care about him. If you like, travel to Rome and report to Pope. Who cares? How dare you touch my precious daughter? Don't you know I bless premium on her? Do you know how much I spend in making this guy the next president to be? Yeah? And you are there winkling your eyes. Instead of you to be in the studio releasing music, you are convincing people you are teaching. Yeah? Look at your dreadlock. Do, do uh, teachers wear dreadlock? You hand everything everywhere, possessions, people. So, yeah, 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 you are still protesting with your eyes. 
If you do that again, I will, I will knock off your eyes from the socket. You think I'm here for a joke? You think I'm here for a joke? How dare you stand and look at my face because you're teaching? By the way, what subject do you take in school? Is it music or biology? That's not business. What? Why are you not sir? Ah! I'm talking to you, you are there doing face for me. Look at the type of teacher that is wearing ring on the head. This is how you possess people's children. Nonsense. Mark her. Any other time she dares to flog you again, then we'll launch Second World War. This one just is a primary distinct. Selecting of who will be the president. That's what we have come to do. Now let us go. Don't worry. You come back to school tomorrow. You see what I'll do to you. Then you come back to school tomorrow. You have to you. You be your president tomorrow. You know how much I pay for the school fees. <laughs> The only precious daughter of my father. This one you shifted our table to this position. What are you reading? Book. Book. Oh, book. Okay. So, why are you here? Well, I just want to apologize for hitting you the other day. I dress with properly. Oh, hi. I'm not you. Okay. Okay. Her Excellency. Mm. What do you say you want? Like I said before, just to apologize. New. New. What? You just say as you knew. Yeah. You want to apologize to me, right? Knew if you really mean it. But again, I can see that you're getting out of hand. I mean, how can you ask me and make your senior brother to knew because I, 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 I want to apologize for hitting you the other day? But again, you are insane. I won't do that. You won't only kneel before me, but you will bow. After all, Papa have put me in charge. Did he sent for me? Yes, I did. <clears throat> Sit down. <clears throat> is it true that that boy you are planning to get married to is only doing so because of what he wants to gain from me? Daddy, what are you talking about? Obageli overheard him discussing over the phone with someone that he is only doing so because of what he wants to profit from me. Obageli must have misheard. It better be so. Because I am not ready to give out any of my daughter to any person who is irresponsible. I am not ready at all. Lady Ejike is an honorable man. It better be so. Because if he is not, I will make sure that I get you a better person who is capable of taking care of you and also giving me a good treatment. <sighs> Daddy, Edgar is the right man for me. You think so? Yes, sir. You think so? Yes. <sighs> what they call such behavior is self-ingrandizement. Each really alone he wants to get something where you did not so. Or will he go? It's an, a dangerous criminal act. It is not like that. Uh, look at your eyes. <laughs> look at the way your eyes is protesting in the socket. Are you sure that this boy is not uh, doing doing this? <laughs> look at you. That is stop kidding. I want to go and see educate. I am just complaining about that same educator and you want to go and see him. It means 
is doing some things that others let me tell you some handsome men out there do you know that useless but they call chima he can even do better than that <laughs> look at you look at please you. stop kidding now <laughs> i'm coming <laughs> hey. hmm. I just hope that the reason why you are defending him is not because of uh, your interest in his middle. That is just what I want to be sure. Baby, just do that okay? No way. Hi, Edike. We no greet a child or bow to her. No way. I don't mean a girl of 11 years. 11 years. More Edike bow to her. Mbanao. It's not done. It's an abomination. Just bow to her. Be nice to her. I don't want to go through what my sister Ijima went through before she got married. Please. Yes. Your sister Ijima? Yes. What are you talking about? Hmm. At first, my sister Obiagiri did not like the, the man she got married to. Whenever the man comes to her house, she starts crying, screaming. And my father refused to give my sister's hand to the man, saying that whenever a child cries at sight of a man, that means the man is bad. My God! And what did your sister do? At first, then try scaring her into keeping quiet, but it did not work out because we, we all know that she was acting. But not until the man changed and started buying things for her, bribing her be. But my my dear, thank God now they are happily married. This is serious. Yeah. Kitty, you see, obviously your sister is like this because you all endorse her. Are you serious? Yes! My dear, you think that I will not try to stop all this. But we tried all our best. There is nothing we have not done. See, I, ADK, will never bow to Obiageli. Tell her that this is a guy her attic will never work for. I can't bow for Obiageli. No way! Obiageli won 11 years. One more but I'm going to A girl I know they gave back to her. No way! I will not bow to her. Tell her that. Emeka, so you have not seen the snow box. I, I, I'm, I'm coming, I'm coming, Papa. Hurry up now. I was wondering if you did not see it. <laughs> you know the weather is not uh, friendly. Ah, Papa, you're taking this in too much. You still like this, you know. Let me tell you, I met my father while he was taking this, so I know what I am doing. <laughs> ah, but I will not take it with you now. No, I will not. Uh, I will not. I will not. Uh, I don't even encourage you. Uh, hey, Papa, that reminds me. What about the money you promised me? You know, the goods will be coming in by next week, and I need to pay in advance. <clears throat> Emeka, Papa. I have no money to give to you. Do you hear me? <laughs> Boy, you promised to give me the money, Papa. Of course I did. That was before you started threatening your sister, Obegeli. Papa, you know Obegeli caused it. All the same, you don't like her. I don't believe you do. I don't at all. <sighs> Papa, Obegeli is my kid sister, you know. I mean, how can you believe on earth that I will ever hurt her? Uh, can I ask you a question? I am very sure that you are familiar with Bible passages. Did Jacob ever believe his own sons will sell Joseph to slave trade? Huh? Papa, I'm not Joseph, neither Jacob. I'm Emeka, your only son. I mean, your only son. I know. You don't need to remind me about yourself. I know you are a maker, my only son. Uh, my only son. But let me ask you a question, Emeka. Have I not been giving you money in this house? Uh, haven't I been giving you money in this house? Have you asked me one day, Father, if my late father used to give me money as much as I do to you? Papa, Honestly speaking, I can't believe that you, you're just refusing to give me the money because of what that girl Obagiri told you. Because she went and concocted story on her own. 
I, 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 I don't just understand. Please, I need this money. Please. Emeka, the earlier you start believing, the better for you. I've told you several times that I don't joke with that Obegeli. I love and appreciate that girl. Let me tell you one thing. Obegeli is like a jewel in this house. And every one of you should try and love as much as I do. Otherwise, there is no favor coming your way. Eh? But, Papa, you please, Emeka, this discussion is over. You are disturbing me. Ah, uh -uh. Am I going to run away from you? Okay, don't worry. I better leave this place for you since you don't want me to enjoy my snow. Papa, you mean? It's not because of what? Please, don't disturb me. What kind of family is this? I'm tired of this family. Go and come back. You must give me the money, oh. Sure, let me go and see Mama inside. Mama. 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 You have, you have to talk to Papa. You have, you have, you have to give me the money, oh. I mean, I have to clear my goods now. Um, Emeka, you have to calm down. Hmm? You know that I have tried. I have tried my best. Besides, you know that if I have, I would have given you. But what you need is big money. Enough to establish you. Are you hearing me? Then you need to ask from your father. It is your right to receive from him, especially now that he sold the land. But he's refusing to give me the money. Just because of that little brat. In as much as it hurts me so much, it crushes my heart to see what your father has turned Obegeliako into. This is a time I and your sister have agreed to one thing. But will you rather lose 3 million naira because of Obegeliako? Will you allow her to stop him? Mama, I called her little brat, Her Excellency, as she demand. Then she asked me to kneel. How can you ask me to kneel before that little brat now? I am not the one asking you to kneel down. No. It's not me. I am not. But uh, will you lose what your father promised you? Will you? Are you willing to lose it? Mama, as it is now, Seth, I don't I don't think that Papa will give me the money. Even if even, even if I, I need for that little brat. At least Emeka. Try and soften her heart so that she won't stand on your way of receiving your own lion share. You are the first born, huh? Or would you rather allow pride to stop you? Obi, please, may I speak with you? You may speak. What? Did I ask you to sit? Sorry, Your Excellency. Please, may I sit? You can sit. Thank you. Obi, I just want to know why you treat us the way you do. We're supposed to be brothers and sisters. We are one big family. <laughs> do you want to know why I asked you all to bow for me? Yes. Despite the fact I'm the youngest in this house, I'm the queen in this house, and I also rule this house. And once my dream come true, I mean, once I become the president of this country, you have to start practicing how you will treat me. Okay, but is anyone complaining? No, 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 not at all. I just want to know whether you like to play at times. Oh, I don't want to play, you know. I played at school and I'm also with my phone, so I'm okay. What? Did I ask 
to leave. Sorry, sorry, your excellency. Now get out! It works! She just called me Her Excellency. I can't believe it. Oh! I can't wait to become the first female president of this country. But it's all right. I will process it with them. <laughs> How are you? Hey, hmm. If you think you will marry my sister, no! I won't allow it. Not until you learn how to respect me. Obi, are you talking to me? Yes. You won't allow it. Who do you think you are? I am her excellency to be. Now, let me tell you. You must bow. And you expect me whenever you see me. And you must also address me as Her Excellency. Don't say I do not want you. I can't believe this. Me, Edike, bow. Call you Her Excellency. Wait a minute. Did you say I, I should not say you didn't want me? Who are you wanting me? I can see something is wrong with you. You are crazy. You are the one who is crazy. Yes, I am already seeing the craziness in you. It is flowing in your blood. Now, if you think you will marry my sister without my consent, oh, educate, you must be joking. Yes! You are actually talking to me in that manner. You don't have respect. Why are you running? You don't have respect at all. Me, educate, bow before you. Oh, you want to destroy you. Let us see! Let us see! <laughs> Can you imagine? You took care of yesterday! Can you imagine? You, the, you want me to bow? I heard you bow before you! Little girl of yesterday! I didn't even call you higher fancy! I can see you, you lack manners! I will teach you what your family cannot teach you! I will teach you how to respect your elders! Rubbish! The, Ikachi! 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 Obi, what is it? Um, Naya, tell Ikachi that she should better than look for another husband that she marry because she will never marry NGK. Yes, she will never! Eh? What did you just say? What happened? He thought I needed some mana and he scared me! He found me seriously! See my legs! See! Hey, he's mad. Is he mad? Hey, I've told you. I've told you. Hey, wahala. Hey, sister. The mountain, sister. Trouble. What do you mean, sister? Okay, then we just returned. Mm -hmm. It seems that our lady can flood her. What? <clears throat> Are you sure, sister? <clears throat> that is not even the problem, self. She said I should tell you that you should start looking for another husband. That our lady will never marry you. Hey! <clears throat> Why did you get flogged down, my small sister? We need trouble! I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This thing will not kill me. My sister, I need to go. I'm coming. Hey. Hmm. Photo, why would you play DK Flog of your girl? Eh? That she devil of a girl. Hmm. This is another trouble, though. This is another trouble.
Hi, baby. I was actually on my way to your house. I hope your little terror have told you what I did to her. Baby, you don't know what I've done. Come on, stop panicking. Our beggarly need little discipline. But I told you to leave her alone. Be nice to her. Look at what you just did. Please, you need to apologize to her before my father returns. Stop it. I mean, can you listen to yourself? You actually want me to apologize to a child who disrespected me and I corrected her. Do you know what she told me when she came back? What? That I should go and start looking for another husband. That you will never marry me. I mean, Abegeli is just your kid sister, not your mother nor your father. But she leaves the house. My father does whatever she wants. Please, apologize to her. Or my father will not approve you. Okay, don't worry. I will come and see your father. Not until you apologize to Obi. Please, let's go. Don't say sorry to her. No, I won't do it. I mean, I am a man. How do you expect me to apologize to 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 Odegeli, a little girl? I can't do it. I won't do it. Baby, just do it for my sake, please. I said no. Please, no. I won't do it. See, I educate. I will never. I will never do it. I will never apologize to Noye. For what? What do you even take me for? A fool or what? You want me to apologize to a little girl who disrespected me? I corrected her, and you want me to? Please, please, please now. Sister, sister, I'm calling you. Sister, sister, I saw you. Where's the girl? Don't know. I haven't seen her since she returned. I think she's hiding, so that I won't apologize. And now she'll tell Papa, I'm proud of forbidding from marrying again. But sister, did Uncle Ejika agree to apologize to her? No, Ejika refused. So what am I going to do now? Sister, what else could you do rather than looking for a way to apologize to that brat? Apologize to her? To that small girl? I won't apologize to her. Sister, you have to. Unless you don't want Uncle GK to marry you. Even if I do, I'll just do fake one. It's not for my heart, though. Sister, fake one no, or real one. My own is apologize to that brat. Yes. I wish HK listening to me. At least I won't be going through all this stress. Ah. I'm just trying to apologize to her. You have to. Her Excellency, Her Excellency. Good afternoon. How are you, Mika? I'm fine, though. Ah, where is everyone? No worries at all. Okay, um, I bought this for you, High Excellence. Hmm. Trying to bribe me? Not that I'm trying to bribe you, but I just want you to forgive me. I'm sorry. Emika, hey, not as if I don't like this thing you bought for me, but. I have not changed my mind because I still want you to kneel. Just for me to kneel, right? Yes. Fine. But if, if I do that, will you tell Papa to give me the money? No. Because you still have to give me some little money to buy snacks. Why? I mean... Papa do gives you money for for snacks. Mm, yes, but not every time because he said that I don't. Don't worry. I still want you to give me the money. Okay, okay, but just for one week. Let me see. Okay, one week. One week, right?
Yes, now new. New fast. No, it feels good. One day, I will be the president, and everyone will bow and kneel for me. I, 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 I don't think that people do do kneel or bow before 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 the president. But they do it for the king. Why can't they kneel and bow before me? Once I become the president, every single soul will bow and kneel before me. Now, take this. Read it for me. Fast. After the minute, can I, can I stand up? Um, no, because you see, I have many things to do for me. Alright. Benefit for the fact that it was the month of July when they learned you. I hope you are listening, right? Yeah, I'm listening. When they learned you used to come frequently, it was not. Cover yourself with wrapper like this. Papa, it is Sister Nkechi. Yes? She told Boda GK to beat me. Amagito. Ejike beat you? Hey! Where is Nkechi? She's inside. Hey! Nkechi? You get you in there? Yes, daddy. Bia, come. You get you? Yes, so that idiot that wants to marry you, that AGK, beat up my daughter on the road. Daddy, it's just a little misunderstanding. What is misunderstanding in it? He told Kabageli disrespected him. So he tried to correct her. No, even with that, does Ejike have the right to beat up my precious child? Then, I mean, a, a future president? Is he mad? Daddy, please, we are sorry. Please, it will not happen again, please. Obiageli, I've scolded him and he promised to apologize at once. You know, he wasn't that serious. Please. Mm. You know, he acted as if it was. But, what if he marries you? And he starts beating you. Oh. No, he will not beat me. He lost me. Hey! There is trouble in a lackage. You know what? Tell that idiot. Tell that educator or whatever you call him. That I don't want to see his legs in this house again. Mom. Yes! Abu okay. This is final. But hey! Begin, please, please. Daddy, I will do to him what Africa did to Gaddafi. I promise you do not repeat again. Please, but don't do this to me. Aha, uh -huh. Abagari, I hope you kept the clothes well. Oh. Hmm? Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. Papa, mm -hmm. have you given Emeka the money? <sighs> of course I have not. Why? Don't you want him to be rich? So that he can build us a big house. D. 
Do you think I should give him the money? Yes, of course. You've promised him. Besides, he's your only son. I think you're right. I, I am going to give him the money. Good. Thank you. <laughs> you know one thing? You are a very smart child. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> Obegiri, have you eaten? Yes, of course. Uh, yes, I, I, I said the money to you now. Uh, no, 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 no. Sorry, I did not give my back. See, I just did it before the, before the money was all that. But now I've got it. I believe. Uh, you know what? Uh, I'll, I'll call you to explain everything to you. Yeah? I'll call you. Hmm. Obi, Obi, the only precious daughter of our father, the only queen that can decree and it will happen. Thank you very much. Hmm? I guess Papa will give you the money. Yeah, yeah, sure. Sure, he did. Thank you. I know he did that because, because you, you suggested this for him, Abi. Thank you very much, eh? Um, don't just bother yourself. Hmm? When um when I clear my goods, I will I will get you a better gift. Hmm? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much once again. You know I love you very well. Huh? Hmm? Um, let me let me talk to my agent so that I will clear the goods for us. Huh? Come, let me just. I need to call my agent. Yeah. So like I said, yeah. Anyone who does what I want will get what he or she wants. As for that useless man called AGK, once I'm true with him, he will learn how to expect me, the president of this country. I can't wait for people to bow to me. Jesus Christ, what are you doing here? Good afternoon, sir. What is good about this day? I am asking you. Have I not warned you not to step your feet in this compound again? Get out of my compound. Turn your back and leave my compound. Sir, did you recognize me? Of course, I recognize the fool. The good for nothing idiot who think he can beat up my daughter and still have the opportunity of marrying one of my daughters. I recognize you very well, Educa. Get out of my compound. Sir, I know, but how. Mr. Man, you know nothing. You are a fool. I said, get out of my compound. Get out of my compound. Papa, educate. Nkechi, what is this fool still doing here? I need to have told you not to allow this fool to step his feet in this compound. But, sir, uh, educate us. Get out of my compound. I will do something drastic. Get out of my compound. You think I still have. I have told you, I don't want to give you any consent. I don't want to give you any listening ears. Get out. Oh, sir, let me do You want to test the devil? Ah, the devil in me. Get out of my compound. Let him get out of my compound. Take it easy now. Get out of my compound. What is this? Get out. Get out of my compound. Get out. You think you can beat my precious jewel and still have the opportunity of marrying my daughter? But I don't like what you are doing, no. I what don't is like that you don't like. Nonsense. I do, let me. The next time I see your feet, I, 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 will, I will break your leg. I will make sure I shoot you down, idiot. I want to come and marry. Yeah, we want. Please wait now. Baby. Wait now, please. Educate. Oh my God. Can you be pleased now? Uh, baby. Educate. Educate. What is it? What is it? Wait, wait now. You see, you get to let me be. Eh, your father slapped me. Just because I tried to correct that little girl. Ah, Educate, I know. My father did not do the right thing. But you should know my father does not joke with all be. Is that the reason why your father should slap me? Eh? 
I am sorry. Why shouldn't I have come at least until he comes down? Okay, I only came because I want to talk to your father man to man. That you don't understand. There is no talking to my father until Obi is accused. And now my father has kept me not to have anything to do with it again. What? That's crazy. How can your father decide your own future based on what that little girl said? Baby, we want to deal with Obi and put her in her place. But if you do that, my father, you will have my father to deal with. And what kind of a daughter will I be if I keep on fighting with my father every time? And which man would like to marry a woman like that? Nketi, I will still not apologize to that little girl. No way! I mean, I mean, I mean, how can I, ADK, apologize to a girl I give about 20 something years? It's a abomination now, I don't call I can't do it! Baby, please now. At least for my sake. Please. Please now. Baby, please. Don't do it for my sake, please. No. Please now. It's okay. Thank you. I'm just doing this because of you. Just because of the love I have for you. Thank you. I'll try to talk to your father again. That will not work. Unless you apologize to all B. Please. Don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. It's all right. Mm -hmm. See you. Good day, sir. Educate. What is it? Sir, I know you are angry with me. But, sir, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to offend you in any way, sir. If you don't mean to offend me, what do you intend to do? What is it? Sir, I only gave Obageli, whom I see as my younger sister, correction, sir. But you misunderstood me, sir. I misunderstood you. I misunderstood you. So what you are insinuating now is that I don't have the capacity of training my own child. Eh? Is that what you are trying to say? No, sir. I never said that, sir. Sir, you know, I love your family very well. That is why I want to marry one of your daughter. Sir, one person does not own a child. Just like our people used to say, that one person don't train a child. Oh, you people want to gather in congregation to help me to train my own child. Not only that you insulted me that I misunderstood you, you are telling me that I lack the capacity as a man eh, to train my own child. Educate. Is that what you are insinuating? So you are indirectly now calling me a stupid man. Eh? So you are now calling me a stupid man. God forbid. How can I call you a stupid man, sir? No, if you didn't call me a stupid man, what is it that you are calling me? No, you said that I misunderstood you, which means I don't have memory. I don't have brain to know when somebody is going here and there. That is what you are trying to say. That you can have always respected in my house. But you touching that girl, you have touched my life. I don't like it. Let me warn you for the very last time. Because you have, you have touched that jewel of, that I love, that epitome of African beauty, I don't want to see you near my house again. Stay clear from my house, Ejike. But, but sir, Ejike, this discussion is over. Stay away from my family, Stay away from my family. Ah. If I see you near my house, you this boy, if I see you near my house, how can you be the, the, the jewel I have in my house and you are telling me that I, I misunderstood you? I don't know who came in a man. I don't know So you call me a stupid man, eh? This is a man with a capacity. You tell me why God gave me a child and you say I cannot. You are the one that wants to come and train it. Look at the way you bend your cap when you train a mother. In Kechi, what is it? Hmm? Mama, HK has refused to apologize to Obi. My father has stopped me from seeing EGK, so how can I marry a man without my father's consent? Of course you need his blessings. You need his blessings. But mother, the only way to get his blessings is for me not to marry EGK. Even if you bring 
someone else. Will Her Majesty still not be pissed off? <sighs> Mother, you know I love AJK so much. I don't want to lose him. Please do something now. Don't worry, my daughter. I know that AJK will definitely come by. I will personally talk to him. If he takes me to kneel down and beg him personally, I will do that. You know I will do anything for you. Hmm? Mama. Oh, you didn't know you. Mm. Just brighten up, okay? Brighten up. Hmm? What are you going to do, Ibo? Emeka, honestly, I can't believe this. Your father is actually 100% ready to forfeit me as a son-in-law. Just because I corrected her precious daughter. Does it mean Inkechi's happiness doesn't count? Educate my brother. I don't know what else you want me to say. But honestly speaking, that is what we are facing in our house. But if you love my sister and you want to marry her as your wife, like you said, all you need to do is do what the brat wants. That is just it. See, Emeka, Emeka, that is the problem here. Hey, how am I sure this will work? Your father has already warned me to stay away from his family. Eh? Hey, Jack, forget about my father. Just do what the brat wants. Believe me, it will work out. Are you sure this will work? Are you sure this will work? It's very sure. Hmm? I'm giving you my words. And take it. That is just it. Okay then. Uh, I really don't have a choice. Yeah, that's my guy, Jai. Meaning that you do as I said, right? I want your sister out of that house as fast as possible. I really love her. So if it means me calling to your younger sister just to get your sister into my house where she rightly belongs, make us I don't have a choice, I will do it. Um I jack my brother. That is all we are facing. Mm -hmm. You also have to be there with us, okay? Okay, okay. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. But I'll see you next time, okay? Sure. Uh, let me take a nice look. Mm -hmm. Ah, a jike. Call to that little brat. Ah. Anyway, I don't have a choice. I, I, I really love him, Katie, so I just have to do it. For love's sake, I will. Yes, Nancy. I got this gift for you. It's a token from my heart. Just to apologize for disrespecting you. Please, I'm very sorry. And I want to seek uh, your permission to ask your father for a sister and a marriage. I really love your sister and I want to marry her. <laughs> so you love my sister? Yes. <laughs> and you want to marry her? So you think getting me this small gift will give you the right to see my sister? This is just the beginning. Anything you want, it shall be yours. Hmm. <laughs> Are you sure? Very sure. So, anything I want now, I will get it. Yes. Okay. I want you to do 20 from job. From job? Yes. Now? Now! It's okay. Now. You've only done 11. Uh -uh. Nine more continue. Please, I'm tired. You're tired. Ah, tired. You still have more to do. Okay. You still have more. I want you to do pig pain. Pig pain? Yes. Okay. You yeah, have fine, okay. <laughs> mm. I 
I eat or watch? Yes. Eat for 20 minutes. Okay. And your leg, carry top. I'm not through, you are not. I'm not through. Let me just speak to you. Oh. Thank you so much, Your Excellency. Move down, move down. No, no, go and marry. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Baby, I'm sorry. Uncle GK, please forgive my younger sister. It's okay, you don't need to be sorry. I should be the one being sorry. If I've listened to you, all this thing wouldn't have happened. It's okay. Yes, sister. Uncle GK is right. Oh, how I wish I'll find the man that would love me this way. <laughs> don't worry, you will. Okay, sister. Don't okay. worry. You find a man that loves you more than I do, sister. Go, oh, Uncle. Baby, let me go on my way. Uncle Ejike, don't worry. I'll tell Mama to talk to Papa this evening. Mm. Maybe Papa will give his consent and you proceed with the preparation. Oh? Please, I will really appreciate it. I'll do that. Thank for you me. so much. Thank you. Baby, just let me go on my way. I will see you later. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Bye bye. Sister, you are so lucky. Yo. This man really loves you. Thank you. <laughs> God, God, give me somebody like you. to play with my little sister. She wants to so you get out. Obi, you know Papa loves you very well. Mm, so? Obi, you know I'll soon be going to the university. And they've started giving admission to my badge. Papa promised to give me money before. But you know, he gave Brother Mecca a lot of money. And you know Papa loves you very well. So, what do you suggest I should do? So that Papa will give me money immediately. Yeah. Mm. Okay. You came on the right place. You know, you know I'm the only one that holds Papa Melissa. And he will do whatever I want him to do. But because of I like you, I will tell you. Thank you, Your Highness. My princess. My lovely sister. Okay. Let me go and continue what I'm doing. Let's try to me. Thank you, Your Excellency. My princess.
I thought he said he would bow to me. Hmm. Now, he knows who is the madam of this house. Hmm. But where to? Inkechi would you marry. And Nene will still go to the university. How would he not do work in this house? Is it me? No. So, only Mama will be the one staying in this house. And there will be nobody to bow to me. <laughs> hey! But Emeka, but Emeka will still leave this village. Mba. <laughs> Nene must stay. She must stay. But. Papa will not refuse to pay his school fees. He wants all his students to be a graduate. And he also wants Neye to be a doctor. What am I going to do? <sighs> yes! <laughs> I know what to do. So that's exactly how things were. During the war, I was a super intelligent officer. You know what? My Kogapatapata, the officer in charge of my own brigade, the battalion where I served, eh? The man loves me because whenever they throw those big rockets, hmm, I will use my mouth and catch them. For real? What are you talking about? Hmm? We are brave. Me? Ah, brave is an understatement though. Whenever I have those big rockers, I think they say, wah, 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 wah. they will say, where is him, where is him? I will appear. Ah, I will grab it, all of them, they will clap. <laughs> I tell you, I was a very, forget that I'm just selling land though. I was a very strong soldier. <laughs> that is it. Papa, hmm? Papa, I would like to speak to you. Mm. Go ahead. So what is it? Papa, they have started giving my brush admission and I would like to start processing my own next week. Is that so? Yes, Papa. Um, Naye, you want to go to the university? Hmm? Where can you learn trade? Yes, you can use one year and learn trade, like hairdressing or tailoring. In that way, you won't have to come home every time to ask for money. See, you know what? You are a super intelligent girl. You are a genius. <laughs> Don't you think what your sister is telling you is the truth? Hmm? Why don't you learn a trade, at least tailoring or hair making, before going into the university? With the level of full employment in this country now, you think it's it's a very good idea for you. But Papa, I'm going to study medicine. I don't have one year to waste playing another thing. Uh, you 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 are now arguing with me, isn't it? <laughs> Go and learn a trade. Go and learn a trade. You it's good. Oh, you are talking like this. What of if something happened to me tomorrow? As, no. as a woman, don't you think you need to fall back to something? Papa, this is not fair. This is not fair to are you. You know, I I'll deal with you. But, but, but this is not fair. Respect. You don't have respect. Mwaka. Um, but Papa, I think she's angry. Let her be angry. Leave her alone and let her be angry. Do you know what? One day she will come back thanking you for this beautiful suggestion that you just made. Eh? My dear, everything was so expensive today in the market. Even I could not, I was not even able to buy everything I wrote down on my list. Really? Yes. Did you buy the wig for me again? Ha. I wanted to buy it too. But then, something that I bought 5,000 naira, they now said it's 12,000 naira. Uh -huh. hmm. But you, you promised now. I will kill her. I will kill that girl. I will kill that girl, Mama. 
Kill in Canada, kill, kill, kill. Who will you kill? No, you what happened? <laughs> Could you believe that? I went to ask Papa money for my admission fees. And your useless daughter suggested that you stay one year to let her dress and sell that thing. And Papa agreed. What? Jesus. This is something else. Are you fit? <laughs> Mama. Mama, I swear, if Papa did not give me that money, eh? if Papa did not give me that money, I will kill her. I will shove her with my bare hands and face the law. Please, please come down. How can a small girl of 11 years be controlling the whole family? Let her pray that Papa gives me that money. If not, she's dead. Please, calm down. My daughter, Mama, you need to do something else. I think she meant everything she said. I have not seen her like this before. I have not seen her like this before. Please do something. What have I not been doing in this house? What have I not been doing? Eh? Touches your clothes, except if you bring them out for washing. I know, but I can't find them apart from this one I'm wearing. No, I want to go up. You touch me like where? I did. Yes, Mama. You heard me, Your Majesty. I took them. And you will only wear these clothes you're putting on until Papa gives me money for my school. You did what? You think you rule this house? You rule because you allowed you to. Let Papa not give me that money. Let's see if you not run away from this house. How dare you? By the time I'm through with you and your father. <laughs> oh God. Chinenya, go in there and bring her clothes for her. Mama, please stay out of this. Stay out of this. Your husband and your husband feel they will control everybody in this house. No, Mama. I'm ready to teach them a lesson. I will so deal with them in this house. Mama, I Mama, Mama, I want to get to give my clothes to. Mama, what? Oh, what did I hear? My poor brother, sister, get out of here, foolish child. <laughs> okay, no problem. No problem. It's a bad deal. But once my war has started, nobody should complain. Nobody should complain. Spoiled child. Let your father be spoiling you. That is, they just come and spoil my mood. Hmm. Papa, hmm? it's why I wear eyeglass nowadays. Hmm. What is wrong? See, one moment, my olive tree. That defines how serious things have become. You know, you are soon going to be a president. Hmm? So, I want to practice how those people that follow the president behave. Mm. That is why you see this sun shade. And mm. besides, I want to make it, these people, eh, in this side, I want to show them how serious things have become. Because if they are seeing my eyes, they will think I'm just joking with them. Mm. Good. That's me. <laughs> I think I need to... Oh. Papa, hmm? food is ready. Uh -huh. Yes, Papa. We've been expecting you since now. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, no ma, please. Have your own spoon. Hope you watch this spoon. Yes. Yeah. It should be now. No, please eat. Let us enjoy ourselves. Let us enjoy ourselves because what you what Chinene. Papa. What is the meaning of this? Meaning of what, Papa? Do not stand! Who prepared this food? Mama did. And I poured sand in it. What? Papa. You did what? That is what you and your daughter will be eating until I get my money. You what? You did what? Have you gone insane? Yes, Papa. I'm mad. 
You and your daughter have made me mad. Uh, Papa, can you believe that this girl, I mean, this girl, seized all my clothes? What? Did you do that? Yes, Papa. And I seized yours too. Papa, Papa both of you will wear only this clothes until I get my money. And if you dare buy her another clothes, I will burn them, Papa. Try me and see. Try me and see, Papa. Try me and see. Chinanye, uh, Chinanye. You are daring me in this house, you bloody dick creatures. Is it a holiday? Be you mechanical at the source of your own profession. You speak what trade are thou you? Huh? Come and remove this thing before Iraq will turn to Saudi Arabia. Mayor, please give me what I'm testing. You will stay there and wait for your father to return and give you water. You will only drink water when your father returns. Maya, I won't beg you anymore. I won't. I don't want Papa return. He will surely deal with you. Oh, you are still talking, Abby. You are still talking. You will die first. You will be the first person to die before your father returns. Idiot. Maya, I want to drink water. Maya. <laughs> Papa! Papa! Only! What is this? Papa, give me money for my admission! Give me money for my admission! Or else I will kill this girl in this house! I will kill her, Papa! You are a very wicked person! Papa, you know you have the money! You have the money, but you just don't want to give it to me! No. I will kill her, Papa! I will I kill her! Do not give me that money! You are a very wicked person! Don't worry, I will teach you a lesson you will not leave. You haven't seen anything yet. By the time I'm through with her in this house, you will give me that money by the You are just jealous because she's going to be a president. All of you are jealous. Get up. It's okay. It's okay. Put yourself together. Look at what you have done to your, to your younger sister. Papa, you haven't seen anything yet. I, I will make sure that you haven't seen anything yet. I will so deal with you in this house. You. you I will cannot. deal with you. You cannot. It's yours. Thank God I came Let's back. Thank God I came back because otherwise you would have killed her. It's you, are, you are a genius sister to the devil. I will deal with you in this house. Papa, give me the money I need. Give me the money I need. Let me get out of here, Papa. Papa! I, I don't have any money for you. Did you put any money in my pocket? Papa, I'm warning you. I'm warning you. I'm warning you now that nothing has spoiled. Give me the money for my admission, Papa. Hey, yeah, hey. The country is hard. No money. Shut up. The country is very bad now. I don't have any money. Can't you hear what she just said? Okay, Papa, you don't have money, eh? You don't have money. Okay. Don't well, prepare to bury your precious daughter. Let's eh? see if you don't have money to buy your house. Let's see if you don't have money to buy your house, Papa. The, what, what, the, Little Oma, you are here watching your daughter manifesting. Check if this thing is evil spirit. I don't. One how? Don't call me at all. We can only tell you what you are doing. You are the fault. You, you, it is because of your other things that are happening. It is your fault. It's never my fault. Deal with it. It's never my it fault. It is your fault. Deal with it. I don't like what is going on. Emeka, you are there watching your sister. You are there watching your sister. No, no, don't, don't, don't just call my name. Don't, call, don't involve me in this matter. You cost it, Papa. You cost it. Just go, 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 go visit yourself. Don't just call my name, I beg. But don't do Oh, but I don't do it. 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 I do I I I it is not on this body. Okay. I forbid it. Don't even point at her. No, is there anywhere you are standing? I'll give you a you after you live to regret all your life, Fabiana. I called you here to report your mother to you. I don't, I don't like what your mother is doing. Your mother have refused to talk to her two daughters, especially Chinenye. Nenye seized my clothes and that of uh, Obiageli and threatened to burn them if I dare buy any other thing to Obiageli or buy her another clothes. Okay. <clears throat> when she said that, I even thought she was joking. I never know she meant it. Emeka, as your father speaks to you now, 
the only clothes I have in this world left, and that the one of the girl is wearing, is this one that I am putting on here. Ovula. She burnt everything down. And towards the case, when I tried asking her this afternoon, I didn't know she had already prepared paper water. The next thing I saw, boom, into my eyes. Look at your father's eyes. Eh? What did I do? And now you are complaining, Papa, right? If I may ask you, what else do you expect Nunye to do? Tell me. I don't, I don't understand. Are you, are you trying to side them or what? Papa, I'm not siding for anybody. Not even you. No, Nunye. But at the same time, don't forget that what we are talking about here is Nunye's future. Why will you be playing with that girl's future just to please Obia Geli? That, that, that is not true. What you are saying is not true. Papa, you promised to train Nonye to whichever level she wants. And I still remember that you were the same person that encouraged her to study medicine and surgery, right? Yes, I did. Then why will you at this dying minute Ask her to stay back and learn uh, 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 how to make hair, not so clothes. Papa Dagi has scored nine A's. She scored above 300 in her jump. You know, which you know very well. She was also accepted in UNN for admission. Now tell me, how do you expect her to give up all those things? Just because of Obiangeli, our own last born. Uh, mba, mba. I, I don't want you to go there. This the reason why I call this not about Obiangeli. It's not about Obiangeli. Don't talk. Don't say anything about Obiangeli. Biko, Emeka. Biko. I beg you, please, Papa. Spare me all this trash. Because everybody in this house knows that everything in this house is all about Obiangeli. Yes. I, I resent that. Okay, now let me ask you. Who suggested that Nene stays back to Lesky? Hmm? Papa, I haven't forgotten that you are an advocate of good education, which I know very well. So tell me, why will you on earth ask the most intelligent one out of your children to stay back and learn how to make hair? Not so close. When she knows that she can become a doctor, who in their right mind will accept that? When she knows very well that there is money for her to finish her education, is that why she did what she did? No, you make her. Since you have decided to be siding them, is that why she did what she did? Can't she by herself come to me and speak to me? Am I not her father? Can't she come here and share her grievances with me? Papa, I know Chinenye very well. Maybe you never gave her a choice. I know that she must have tried talking to you. But one thing I discover in this house is this. Once your precious daughter have decreed, no one among us can change it except she alone. That is not true. That is not true. Okay. This is not true. Now let me ask you, when you promised to give me money for my business, who changed your mind then? Was it not that you don't, you don't know that. I do. Because I know what I did before she suggested for you to give me the money, Papa. You that is complaining, at the end of the day, did I not give you the money? Emeka, did you not still collect the money from me? Yeah, you did. But if I must ask you again, who changed your mind then? I don't know that. Now, Papa, let me tell you, in case you don't know. We all call and bow to Obiageri as Her Excellency because you made it so. At first, if I'm not mistaken, you gave your consent to HK 
for him to marry Nkechi. Later, you change your mind just because Obiageri told you some lies. Now you are back again to accept the same guy. Papa, the worst part of it that is that I don't know why Mama should be addressing her own daughter. I mean, her own last born as Her Excellency before you can bring money for food in this house. Papa, let me tell you. Give Nonye the money you have kept for her education. Because this is one time Obiageri will not get her wish. But if you try to push Nonye to the world, believe me, we all will live to regret it. That's all I can assure you for now, Papa. Don't say I did not warn you. Rebecca, you, you have spoken. But is that why Nonye have to uh, put pepper inside water and then pour it to my face? What kind of uh, uh, wickedness is that? Nenumburanyam, I can hardly see anything now. If she feels grieved, why can't she come and talk to me other than destroying everything that we have here? It's a dangerous family. The thing is, that girl is a devil. I am telling you. Hmm? But are you scared? Um, Papa, yes, I'm scared. You're scared? Baba, she says she's going to kill me or give me everlasting mark. I probably think she would do it. I don't know why she hates me this much. I thought we were close. You know, I was wondering why is it that you don't want her to go to the university. Why? Um, Papa, um, I don't understand what you are saying. What I mean is that you are the one who suggested that she go to learn uh, handwork or uh, tailoring or hair making. Hair making. That you are the one who suggested it. Papa, it's not that I don't want her to go to the university. It's just that. And Tikechi will soon marry, and I won't have anyone to stay with me. That is not true. I am here, and your mother is here. The both of us will be here for you. Papa, it's still the same. Okay, you know what? If that is going to make you feel bad, I will. I promise, I will get you a maid. For you? Of course, I can do that for you. Yes, better like it's cool. Papa, thank you. You like the idea? Yes. Why is she excited? Just because I promised to get her a maid. Could it be true that I am truly spoiling this girl or that she's something different? I know you're just saying all these things because I'm doing the housework. You'll be sitting here and I'll finish this and go outside and wash all my clothes. Really? You're washing clothes today? Mm -hmm. Oh wow, I have some dirty clothes too. Hope you don't mind. I was yeah. Uh, I was yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I married you. I don't know what I would have done if I had married one of those strict men who insist their wives do all the dirty work in the house. That was why I swore never to marry a man unless I was sure he loves me beyond reason. Well. Just keep thanking God because I love you. Yeah, and I love you too. And that is the reason why I'm doing all this and okay. I'm doing. Yeah, I know. Okay, please. Look at this place. No, I don't know. This is just the I'll do my stuff. I don't think much. See, baby, look at this place. You know what we're
Okay, I am not done with the one I'm washing. I'm here you are again. I know, but these are not much. Just little. You know I don't know how to do them. Mm -hmm. Sorry, hope the sun is not so hot. Okay, I'm just doing this because of you. Because I love you. I know, and I love you too. It's okay, I'll wash it. Ah, thank you. Meanwhile, let me go inside and get you cold juice very chill juice okay i'm waiting Can yeah i'll be right back i need it yeah. i just want to know that i'm doing this because i love you of course i know that Um, I've been waiting for this. Come on. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> Come on, stop uh -uh. this now. <laughs> I don't like it. Okay, okay. Mm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Okay, okay, okay. I don't want to do this way. Okay. I do why you? Hope you like it. Of course, thank you so much. Yeah. Boy. The sun is so much here. Yeah. I'm sorry. Well, I can't go inside. Let me just stay here and watch you watch it. But you know, I, I, I won't concentrate if you're here. Uh, 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 no, oh, just watch. Mm, I can't go back inside. I'm bored. That means we're going to stay here all day. I don't mind. Really? Yeah. <laughs> right, let's okay. mm. Hope the clothes are not too hard. <laughs> Trying to reach your number, but it, it wasn't going through. I don't know. It could be network or something. I don't know. But I was calling you because there was no phone in the house. And since you don't like to eat a takeout, I didn't know what to do. Wait, do you mean to tell me that you're not eating anything since morning? I drank tea, of course. You don't possibly expect me to be hungry till now. But how about you? 
Well, if you don't worry about me, you should have prepared something for us to eat. You and I know that I don't know how to cook. And yet, you don't make any effort to learn how to cook. Why? Why should I learn how to cook? Of course, you can cook. You can always do that. Exactly. The same way I can mop the house, wash your clothes and do your brother work in the house. Baby. But you know I don't know how to do any of that. I mean, I am not in the mood for any of these arguments. I'll just go in and change my clothes and cause something for us to eat. You don't sound happy. What's wrong? I'm just tired. I'm okay. Okay. I'm just tired. Okay. Alright, I'm coming with you. Tired. No, I'm tired. Okay, you should wait, rest. Okay, I have taken something so you don't have to rush to the kitchen. As you can see, I'm keeping myself busy. <sighs> what is it? I'll just go in and take off my clothes. Okay, take care. I'll meet you soon. What? Because we need to talk about us. Everything. Everything that has been going on in this house. I don't understand. Obegli, after I married you, every morning you complain of hunger without making an effort to make anything for us to eat for that matter. I don't know what to think of. So I decided to do everything myself until you get your bearing. At least I understand what you mean. When I asked you, you said you don't know how to do anything because you're the last one in the house. It was okay because I was willing to teach you. Obiagini boy is six months now. Six good months Obiagini. And you've not shown any desire to do anything. So I, I want to know, what is wrong? Baby, I still don't understand. Do you expect me to go to work? Then I'll come back and do everything in this house, including boiling water for everything you do. But I told you I don't know how to do the things you just mentioned. Because you don't know how to do the things I mentioned. Why have you not made an effort to learn how to do things I mentioned? I don't want to learn. Excuse me? Yes. Nobody wants to do chores. Yes. If I know how to do it, I might have helped just to relieve you. But I don't know how to do, so why should I want to learn? Nobody wants to do choice, Leonard. You are only doing it because you don't have a choice. 
But I have a choice, right? You can do it. I can't. So, Odagali, if I get you right, you want me, Donna, to do everything in this house while you sit there, watch Kelly, eat and sleep and get fat, right? I am not fat. But yes, that is what I expect. Or you can get a maid. My father did. Did I just hear you say maid? Yes. Your father did. Odagali, what about when you give birth? Who take care of your baby, the house, and the other thing in this house? Baby, we can get a nanny. I can see you're insane. What? You heard me, Gagali. You heard me. I am not going to get a nanny or a maid in this house. You're going to do your duty as my wife. I am doing my duty. I am not go to I am not hiring anyone here. I am not. You have to do it. It's your duty. I don't know how to do it. Then you learn. I don't want to. You learn, over again. You learn. I can't continue like this. I cannot. Donald, please. If you're tired of doing house chores in this house, and you won't hire a maid to do so, then who will take care of them? Girl, it's your duty to learn how to do things in your home. This is your home. Like I said earlier, I don't know how to do them. Girl, I am done. I've made my point clear to you. You hear what I said? Donald! Baby! Why are you walking out on me? What am I going to do? Why will my husband suddenly change? He didn't even prepare my breakfast this morning. I thought it was a dream. Or could it be another woman? No. No. He loves me so much and we just got married. Hmm. Now I know exactly what he is doing. He wants to see if I will chicken out and start doing chores. <laughs> He has failed. I will go out there, get something and eat. Let's see who will get tired first. Yeah, let me put this question up.
This is it. And no one will not in this house. I won't take it anymore. No, I will not. I was looking all over the compound for you before coming down here. You can see that I'm busy cleaning and mopping everywhere. You can see that. Where are you going? Oh, Jagelli! Where are you going? Oh, Jagelli! Look at that! Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? It is late! Where are you going at this time of the day? Where I am going to is none of your business! I would rather go anywhere than to stay in this house. You killed Papa and I know it. How dare you? Shut up my stupid mouth. What rubbish is that? I know from that rubbish. <laughs> you and others didn't take care of Papa when he got sick. Simply because he chose me over all of you. Obegeli. But why didn't you send for me? Why did you just take for me? I would have come back to take care of my only father. Okay, Kelly, your brothers and sisters have told you this countless time, but you chose not to listen to them. Lie! I believe them. So you want me to go through telling you all over again? Liars! <laughs> you are lying! Papa cannot forbid you to tell me. You must have answered me, but you didn't send for me. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Did you tell him I abandoned him? Obegeli, <laughs> your father loved you so much that he never wanted to see you in such states. The worst state of his life, he never wanted to see you. Liar! 
you're lying. I will never forgive you for this. I will never forgive you for this. And I will not come back to this house again. Except to come and dance on your grave. God forbid. I'm not going to like this. Why are you, you such? Why are you like this? I'm not going to I'm not going to I'm not going to I don't know why this guy is always harsh to me. Me and her mother. God, you are my witness, so. You are my witness. Mama, you know I didn't mean anything I said. I was just confused, hurting, because I don't understand why Papa do, did not send for me. He was everything to me. So what do you want? What do you want here? Because I know whatever brought you here means you can't get it outside. Mama, don't mama me. Because you have proved that I'm not your mother. The moment you allow your father's sister to act as your mother on your wedding day, anything that is so special to you and also to me, I that bore you in my stomach for nine months, you deny me that, saying that if your father did not come, then I don't deserve to sit there on your wedding day. Mama, I'm sorry, okay? I'm really, really sorry. Please forgive me. All I wanted for you was to bring you up as a good child, just like every other mother. But then, you've always twisted it. You've always twisted it around. Anyway, just like uh, water under the bridge. Never mind, can you find a blue mark here? It's past. Okay, please mama, I understand. I know how you feel. But please, I want you to come live with us. Me. No, Papa. Go live with you. Look at why, Papa. Oh, 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 I thought this might be a good opportunity for us to amend the bridge. May I amend, you know? Be mother and daughter. I am not. I was not born yesterday. I was not born yesterday. Tell me why you came. What do you think, Jimaki? Okay, Mama, but I just told you. Uh -huh. Okay, I am not interested. Mama, Mama, wait! My husband is threatening to end up a marriage. If I don't start cooking and doing house chores as a wife, so I don't know what else to do. So you now want me to be your housemaid? You want me to come and live with you? Mama, how can you say that? Because that is exactly what you've always wanted for all of us. That's exactly what you've always wanted. To turn all of us to your housemaid. But Mama, you know I was just a child. How can you hold what happened then against me? I am not holding anything against you. God in heaven knows. But still, I am not interested. Please. I just wanted to come help me out, you know. Teach me. Hey! Obegeli, oh, did you say teach you? <laughs> bah, I don't think so. I don't think so, ma. Your Highness. Your Excellency. Mm -mm. <sighs> Mama, please. That sister, sister Joma's address that she wrote for me then when she was inviting me for holiday. Please, can you give it to me? Please, I need it. So you now suddenly remember your sister who have been begging you since to come and visit her. But you, you prove other man to that. You now remember her. No, no problem. It's a bad girl. Maybe I will just help you out with that one. Just wait here. Wait here. Let me go to the front page and bring it for you. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Star. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Thank you, God.
My God. I don't know why she don't want to come. I thought she would jump at this chance just to meet my husband and at least know where I live. It's not as if she have a great life here. Good. What am I going to do now? I think I have to go and see Sister Ijoma tomorrow. Yes, that's what I will do. No! 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 I told her I told you I don't need a domestic staff in the house! Huh? But I want her to come and cook. Then she will go. That way I will be learning. Oh, you want her to come and cook? Then you'll be learning. This is how you're learning, right? The one is in the kitchen making something while you sit here. Is this how you're going to learn? Besides, I told you to go back to your family. Let them see what you don't know how to do. It's their duty to do that. Let them do that job. I can't go to my sisters. They are all married. And Mama didn't want to come. Oh, Begali. Begali, we need to look for who will come. Yes! Yeah. I thought she loved me. Get your out of me! She says I love you. I love you, Bagley. That is the reason why I made a very mistake. What are you talking about? Bagley, your mother did not attend our wedding. And none of your siblings did. I should have tried her out to know the reason why they did not come. But not because I love you. Donald, I told you my siblings refused to come because I didn't want Mama to come. Abagali, if Mama is in the wrong, how comes anyone is taking care of you now? We need to look for someone to help you. Please, you know I love you. Yes. And I'm going to tell you the simple truth. You did not just lack parental guidance, training! You lack family training. So go back to your family, let them train you. You need to look for any of your sister who will help you. They can all help you at the same time. No! It's not possible. Excuse me. But they all hate me!
madness. Come. Goodness. Oh, come inside, come inside. No, 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 sit down, sit down, please, please. What's going on? Sit down, please. Please, I can't go to your house. Why? Come inside. No, 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 please. I'm not worthy to enter your house. I'm not worthy. I've done so much, so many bad things in the past. Please. Okay, sit down. Sit. You mean I should sit down? Sit down. Unless I'm resting. Hope you are you. Stop. Um, I'm sorry. I thought you wouldn't want to see me. I just came to see how you're doing. Oh, B. Goodness. I've been inviting you to come over to my house for your holidays for 12 good years. Now you're in my house. You want to know how I'm feeling. Anyway, as you can see, I'm good. My kids are fine. And my husband has gone to work. But meanwhile, mother called me. What's going on? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get her upset. I just wanted her to rescue you, right? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean all I said to her when Papa died. Sister, I, I said to you, I didn't mean it at all. It's okay. I know about all that. And I'm sure Mommy knows too. You... You believe me? I do, my dear. But... Look, Obiagili. I'm done with this but, but, but of a thing. Let's discuss why you're here. Mother called me. She said something about your marriage. That your marriage is about to be over. What's going on? My husband, my husband is threatening to call off the marriage if I don't start doing things in the house. Please, sister. Please, will you help it's me? It's okay. It's okay. I will. I will, okay? But you, but you said mama called you. Huh. You foolish child. Oh, you thought mother called me not to help you. Which mother would do a thing like that? She actually called me to make sure I'll be available to help you out. Anyway, I wanted to wait for you today to come. I should you didn't come today. Hmm. I'll come to your house tomorrow. Trust me. Hmm. Sister, you mean... Mama actually asked you to help me. Of course she did. Which mother would allow her own daughter's marriage to go just like that? Answer me. But Mama acted as if she hated me. That's mother's for you. <laughs> oh, baby. Her Excellency. <laughs> no, sister, please. Let us not go back to the past, okay? Mm. I'm no longer her excellency. Hey, I'll be. Okay, wait. I want to ask you this question. How did you get my address? Mama gave it to me. Hmm. Mama again? Huh? I'm so happy to see you. Yeah, Can we go inside now? You. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> Very well. Okay, place it here. Open the water. Oh, this okay? Oh, it's fit. Get that in here, look. It's okay. Is that okay? Oh. It's okay, it's okay. Bring it, bring it, bring it. Just place it here. Okay, now see what I'm going to do. See this vegetable. See what I'm doing. Okay. Be fast out. Should I be done? Okay, do it, do it, be fast. What are you doing? Oh, it's very strong now. Hold this thing. Ah. Okay, now it's okay. Watch me. See what I did. Now. See what I did. See, look at me, see what I did from here. Okay, from here. 
Oh, it's okay. Just do it. Bring it out. He's very strong. Try, try, try. I'll be fast about it. So you make something for yours. Okay, now just put inside the bottom. I just want to show you how to slice it. And wash it very well. Okay. Wash it properly. You know? They're very dirty. Yes, it's dirty. That's why you should wash it. Okay, see what I'm doing. I just picked feet to show you how to slice it. Okay. Take this by the side. Then raise it. I need to raise this and be fast about it. I'll do it. Yes. Good one. Oh, you see? Take it. <coughs> Let me show you again about it. You don't just waste them in the kitchen. See? Fast, 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 fast. See what I'm doing? Oh, be again. Sister, be careful. Look at your nails. Mm -mm. I'm good. See? Fast about it. Okay. Now, be fast about it. Okay. So you make something for your husband. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you get to it. Mm. Wow. Mm. Nice one, nice one, nice one, nice one. Mm -hmm. See? Ah, so interesting. <laughs> nice one. <coughs> oh. Wow, baby, your hair. Oh my god, my hair is lean out there. Lean? You know you're a good cook. <laughs> <laughs>
Hoffe ich auf jeden. What's all this? Stays all over. Stain? Oh. What is that? I scrub and scrub and scrub. My ribs, even my fingers started paining me. Obiagili, I thought you had to wash it now. But sister, I did everything that you showed me. I even have to use all my power. But the stains remains. It's okay. I will wash it. Eh? I said I will wash them. Ah. Everything? Everything. Just give me water. Oh, thank you so much. And what was the thanks for? For not just hiring someone to teach me things. Oh. You forced me to go to my family. I never knew any of them would want to see me. How much more to talk to me? But now, most of them have, have forgiven me. If I may ask, why do you think that none of them want to see you or talk to you? Is it because of our wedding? No. No. I was bad. And that was the same reason I didn't know how to do anything. But don't worry. I will tell you one day. <laughs> anyway, all that is in the past now. No, I heard you guys have a doctor in your family. Yeah. Neye. My immediate elder sister. Wow. She is 10 years older than me. 10 years? Yes. <laughs> and um, she's the only one yet to speak to me. No. Wow. I was going to suggest if we can make our family doctor. I don't even know the area she specializes in. Anyway, I'm happy at least I'm making progress. Well, I am happy that you're happy too. Yeah. I am glad that you don't look so alone again. So alone? Look, uh, that was actually the first thing I noticed about you when I met you. But it's fine. It's okay. I was Come so on. alone. Papa just died. And nobody wanted me. It's okay. Also, I thought. Oh, come on, baby. It's okay. I, I didn't mean to make you cry. Okay, okay, look. You know what's going to happen? I'm here. I'm here for you. I'm going to be your father, your brother, your sister, everything in Rome. Okay? Come on, take me. I'm sure you know how much I hate to see you cry. Come on, baby. It's okay, it's fine. Huh? Oh, my God. It's okay. Well, I can't wait. 
This looks good. Ah. <laughs> no, you should pray first. Of course I know. I don't know for how long I've been dying for this food. <laughs> So, who's going to pray? Alright, let me pray. Right. God bless and sanctify us for in Jesus' name. Amen. Alright, enjoy and your And bless food. the beautiful woman that prepared the food for me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, baby. I uh, am. Yeah. Wow. So, how is the food? Mm. Well, it's better than the one of yesterday. <laughs> mean. Meaning that you're almost there. You're getting closer. Wow. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. The food is really okay. Maybe. Mm -hmm. This is more than okay. It's above okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I made it all by myself. My sister Ijoma did, didn't help me. Yeah, I know. She was not even here today, I swear. But I really, I know, I know a bit now. You know? Mm -hmm. How? Wait, are you paying someone to spy on me? <laughs> How can I pay someone to spy on my wife? Why? So Look, I. I know you made the soup yesterday and the porridge jam three days ago. Right or wrong? How did you know that? The salt. Salt? Mm hmm. You and I know that you don't like salt. And when your sister was cooking for us, she had the right amount of salt but we do it's always a little bit um, less but it's fine I'm sorry I didn't know that okay, it's okay no, it's fine I'm not complaining okay. next time when I feel the salt is okay I will just add a pinch no exactly just leave it the way you like it. But you said no salt. I didn't say no salt. Just a little different. I noticed it when I was cooking for us. You complained of too much salt when I put the right amount of salt for me. But when I add less, you enjoy the food more. No. I'm sorry. Regularly. You just stop apologizing. Look, your happiness is my priority. So whatever that makes you happy is what you're going to do. In fact, what we're going to do. So it's fine. It's not fine. You can't be eating tasteless food. No, oh, man. I never said... Listen. The food is fine. I am only pointing out how I know you made the food. And since we're going to eat the food together, apart from this, we eat so that according to your taste. Hmm? <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why? <laughs> You're too inquisitive. <laughs> okay, fine. You know, apart from the fact that you don't like salt, and I like salt, hair twice, less salt. It's preferable than too much salt. So if you cook to my taste, that is too much salt for you. So you see my love, there's no way you can please me on this. <laughs> okay. 
Thank you so much. You're welcome, my angel. And thank you for going through all this and just to make me happy. Yeah. You know I can do anything for you. Mm. Because I love you. And I love you, mommy. Mm. <laughs> Alright. Enjoy your meal. Oh. Ah. There you go. Yeah, this is um... Hope you're enjoying it. Mm. This is delicious. You're doing it by you. But I told you that it's going to happen down there. Of course, you should always believe me. <laughs> oh my goodness. I know it's going to happen down there. Of course, you always want to doubt me. But that is the truth. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! <goodness. laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fine. I'm at home, I'm at home. Hey, okay. okay so can I call you back? Or can I call you back? Sure. Sure. My love. You don't look happy at all. What seems to be the problem? Promise me you won't you will not get angry with me. <sighs> Why not try me first? I tried, I tried. But I can't. <sighs> I am lost totally here. You tried what? The clothes. I will wash and wash, still they don't get clean. And my ring will start depending me, including my fingers. My sister tried to teach me, but she said my bones are not strong. So I don't know what to do. My goodness. Baby, I did not marry you because of washing clothes. You are not my washing machine. But they are part of the chores. For God's sake. I only wanted you to know how to do things yourself, not to kill yourself over them. Come on, are you not happy that you can take care of yourself and your husband? Of course I do. That is why I so much wanted to learn this. Okay, you know what? I'll buy a washing machine for you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And any of the cloth that is too difficult for the machine to wash, we take it to a dry cleaner. Really? Of course, baby. Wow, thank you. Oh, maybe you don't have to thank me. You know, I don't want anything to happen to this wrist on your fingers. You know, they are very, very important to me. Most especially in the bedroom. <laughs> wow, I love you so much. You know, loving is the best thing I've ever had. 